And this is week one of slips and hips, which is basically doing a lot of slide work and maybe some fancy styling for both the leagues and the gents later on in the month. So today we focus mostly on slides. Uh, the, the first thing we did is we kind of got people used to using their feet on the floor, not just being all, always on the balls of their feet, but actually being able to roll from the toe of the heel and use that to propel themselves around the floor, and also thinking about using just slight levels to give illusions of, uh, of a slide when they're not necessarily there, and also lunging and then bringing your foot together to, to, to give that illusion of a slide. <laughs> So, we did uh, some different exercises, you guys can do those at home. Remember, we also did the knees forward and the knees back, and we really focused on kind of lifting our center to make it happen. So, we had yeah, rock, rock, step, boom, and then we had rock, step, boom, and then we got it. We also had the side as ones too. But the moves that we put them in were the six count move, and the girls did a knee slide. So, we did one, two, three, full step, three, full step. Right. And then the guys had a slide at a different part. One, two, triple step, triple step. One, two, triple step, triple step. When we're really getting this into this, we let her momentum pull pull us around a little bit and move into our own arm. So we go boom, do do da 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 da. Boom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Depending on how we want to do it. We can do it as a slide and then a pull in, or we can do it as a slide and then a, tr a triple back. The second thing that we kind of, second place where we put a slide was uh, kind of going to go from the left. I should show this. And then we just threw that foot in for kind of a fake slide, if you will. So we come here, a passerby with some power. For as long or as short as you like. We take our time, we lift it out, and pull it up. Even that illusion of a slide, even though that slide can be there, we'll try to do it in this little space. But it can be a slide as we do that too, with this right foot, left foot, left foot, left foot, left foot, left foot, left foot. And the variation on that was similar to our exercise. We went from pop, 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 pop. It's triple step. So it's, it's not just, but it's triple step. And I'm aiming for her to come in straight toward me. I turn to the left a little bit so I can really wrap my arm around her so I can lead this, this, this little step here. And really all I'm doing here is I'm just pressing right on this side of her body with my forearm to cross her out this way. And essentially this step is just this. Rock, step, trip, pull, step, trip, pull, step. Just add a little slide to it. And we just fancy the trip, pull, step. Now remember, your homework is the circle slide, so you want to make sure you work on that because it's a little bit trickier and it's going to use a lot of the same techniques we talked about for the straight on steps. And basically what we're aiming to do with that is we're aiming to make two little figure eights that overlap, or two little circles that overlap. So we're going to stop right from here. We're going to bring this foot around as we bring this foot around. And what we're doing is we're using a prop. In this case, I'm going to use Naomi as a prop. And I'm going to step in and come around. Try to make it so I don't fall backward and forward, don't fall left and right. Red really just come around. And the more you hold yourself up, the more better, uh, more better you'll get at it. The easier it will be to practice. So make sure you work on that. Thank you guys so much for coming to week one.